Champany, welcome. Thank you very much. Good morning, Mayor Hollick and City Council members. My name is Dawn Champany. I'm a resident and a private citizen of the City of Venice and have been since May 2013. Over the past six years, I've done my best to be a collaborative, productive, and involved citizen to help improve and sustain the beauty of our city. My efforts began with purchasing a foreclosed property that had been vacant for almost four years, restoring and renovating both the landscape and the building so that it adds value to the neighborhood instead of remaining an eyesore. I have worked with city engineering department to organize cleanups and stormwater drain labeling events. The most recent was Saturday, in which we finished labeling zone 10, 7 through 10, so that now all zones 1 through 10 are labeled within the city of Venice, educating residents, business owners, and visitors that what goes into the Gulf, uh, the stormwater drains, goes directly into the Gulf of Mexico. I want to thank Kat Herring and Kathleen Whedon for their partnership. They've really been fantastic to work with. This background brings me to the purpose of my public comment. City council members and city employers, employees are all held to a code of conduct and ethics through Municode. According to section 2-170, it is the policy of the city to uphold, promote, and demand the highest standard of ethics from all of its employees, officials, contractors, volunteers, and others who participate in the city's governance. Section 2-170B states it is the intention of the council that this policy, policy is liberally construed to accomplish its purpose of protecting the public against decisions that are affected by undue influence, conflicts of interest, and ethics. Section 2-170C states all employees, officials, contractors, volunteers, and others who participate in the city's governance are required to subscribe to this code understand how it applies to them and to their specific responsibilities and practice it in the city's core values and principles. I'm hereby notifying the council that I had filed an ethics complaint with the state of Florida, Commission on Ethics, complaint number 19-134, dated July 18th, 2019, and that I am filing an ethics complaint with the city of Venice, ethics compliance officer against a current city council member for what I believe are violations of the code of ethics, specifically section 2-172, appropriate conduct, responsible. Item B, demonstrate concern for the proper use of city assets, including personnel, time, property, equipment, and funds. I believe the city council member did violate the code of ethics on June 24th, 2019, when this council person used the city server to conduct a background check on me, a private citizen, using a paid for website, radaris.com, and subsequently used the city server to email the results of that background check to another private email address, n-d-a-n-i-e-l-s-1102 at gmail.com. Request to explain uh, why this council person took this action have gone unanswered, except for a phone call from Mayor Hollick apologizing on behalf of the city, and an email from this council person um, apologizing for any misunderstanding I may have. I'm not sure what part of the violation of my privacy I misunderstand, or what part of the city server to conduct uh, this violation I misunderstand. I also have in my possession 150 other emails that this council person has sent to the same personal email address from the city server with city information. This information was gathered from the public request for information for the time period January 1, 2019 through July 31st, 2019. I'm a private citizen. I'm concerned that any elected official would use city resources to conduct a background check on a private citizen who has done nothing except be a good citizen a partner with this city, an active volunteer, and I am curious what the intended use of the information was. These codes of ethics complaints are against the current council member for seat six and also currently seeking election as mayor of the city of Venice. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ms. Champany. Janine Joyner. Ms. Mayor. Mr. Daniels. I'd like to respond to that, please. Um, I think that she did a good job of not making it personal, and I don't think there should be a response. It's not what we're Mr. Mayor, I disagree. I, I'm entitled to a response to the accusation. I don't think so. I disagree. 
Go ahead. Who's next, Ms. Joyner? Janine Joyner. Janine, uh, welcome. Good morning. 